Check it, check it, check it, check it, check it, check it, check it. Check it, check it. Tennis, 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 tennis. Hey guys, it's Patrick Star. Welcome back to my channel. As you saw from the title in today's video, I will be transforming into none other than Jackie Ara. I love her so much. You guys might know her as LeBron James. I know her as Lil Pumpkin Pie 05. Where she resided at the time. Aloha, thank you for your service, Jackie. If you guys don't know Jackie Aina, subscribe to her. She is a legend, she is a mogul. She is so fierce and fabulous, and she is a trailblazer in the beauty space. I'm here to celebrate her on my channel. Yes, I know I am very late. But y'all know me, I run on CPT, so we just gonna we just gonna go ahead with it. I'm gonna turn it into her. If you guys want to see this transformation, hit that notification bell, subscribe to the channel, and let's just jump right into this video. Bam! All right, to begin, I am going to color correct. I'm gonna take my Dragon Beauty. I really love this stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and take it right here, you guys. But I know every rock and tree and creature. Will they flag me if I sing this? Has a life, has a meaning, has a name. Peter, what's the name? Peter, what's the name? What's the name of this product? <laughs> Dragon Bias. Yes! Woo! Have you ever heard the wolf cry from the blue corn moon? Very good. All right, I'm just gonna blend this out, you guys, because it, we turned the AC off when we film and it's really, really hot. What does Jacqueline do next? Aha! Polvo. She bothers her face. This is the famous jacket thing. I've been doing it because of her. I'm gonna go ahead and take my loose powder. Not Airspun, not Benna, but you know, one of her favorites. Um, this is gonna be the Laura Mercer um, translucent powder. So I like to go ahead and set my pores and my skin. I really love this trick. If you guys haven't tried it, <coughs> why did I take a deep breath? Don't be scared that it will cake your makeup. It won't. Just don't pile it on there. Just press it into the skin. And you can dust off the excess. I'm on the right track, baby. I was. Ball this way, pacha paz up. I love Lady Gaga. Stephanie Germanata, you're my everything. So next, I'm gonna go ahead and take this Born This Way foundation. I am in the color Praline. I love this foundation. It's my everyday. My everyday regular color is golden, but y'all know I like to paint myself different colors. And I'm just gonna go ahead and take it on a large brush like this. Ugh. If you guys have not tried this foundation, it is delicious. I've been applying my, my uh, foundation with a big brush, and I just love how Jackie was a trailblazer in helping curate the shades, the extensions, with um, Too Faced. Pretty badass. I love her. So I'm going to try to be as close as to what base products that she uses, because when I tell you Jackie in person looks plastic fantastic, I just want to punch her. You know, so I can get a drop of sweat and lick it and hopefully I look just a fraction as good as her. That sounded real violent, <laughs> really, really violent. But nonetheless, she slays my eyes. My dark, wrinkly, fake blue eyes. She's amazing, I love her. Oh, and Dennis, don't let me guess that. Uh, Dennis, he is a gentleman. I really get hesitant when I first started coming in this space as a gay man and then I met all these like straight husbands and boyfriends. I was really scared to meet them because I didn't know what they would think of someone like me in this space. And when I tell you I met Dennis in Paris on a brand trip, he was the sweetest, kindest man I've ever met when when it was on that trip. And it was so cute. Um, and I'm so happy that they got engaged and they just des they deserve each other. Yes, I love them so much. Congratulations, I can't say enough. And I'm blending nothing. Oh, oh, Nikita. You left, you missed a spot. If you have a big face, just go in with a big brush. Save you time. I know she likes her NARS for like her full coverage days, but I just had to use born this way. I'm so happy with the skin. So next I'm gonna go ahead and move on to my brows. Um, this is my favorite. I love my benefits, uh, la, 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 precisely my brow. And I'm gonna go ahead and brush this through really quick. All right guys, so I had a concealer. I had to turn the AC on because mother was hot, okay? So what I'm gonna do is take my Cryon TV paint stick. I know Jackie does not use this, but I will be going in with NARS in a little bit, but I love this. I just, liquid concealers don't really work on me by itself. Maybe shape tape, but for me, what has worked best is applying a cream 
and then applying a liquid. And I actually learned this technique from an OG glam girl, Lily Galici. She loves applying a cream first and then a liquid on top. I didn't mean to spill your secrets, mama, but that's the tea. That's the real tea, honey. Okay, boop with the house down boots. When I'm at this stage, I'll be debating if I should do one of these right here, but then... I just don't. Not today, not today, not today. All right, guys, next, I'm gonna go ahead and take Jackie's tried and true. She stands NARS, so this wouldn't be the right video, a Jackie video, if I did not use NARS. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer and the color Biscuit, medium dark one. If there's any in here, you know what? Good thing I have a bag of I have the mini. I'm gonna go ahead and take this and apply this. I like how the liquid just makes it so creamy and radiant and smooth, like in the name. It's just like mixing a cream with a liquid just makes the radiant uh, under eye uh, come to life because you just have to be gentle with the under eyes and treat them with kindness. All right guys, so next I'm gonna go ahead and let this concealer kind of preserve it. Um, I'm gonna go make some tea, get some lunch and uh, Sunbathe while I preserve it, because Jackie likes to preserve her concealer. But does anyone recall when I preserved my concealer as well? I'll wait. Comment down below, pause, and let's see if you shall be correct. Does anyone know? No. No. When? When I was with Nikki Tutorials, remember? Guys, I don't know if anyone else does this, but I cook my concealer. It's probably like the weirdest thing. Girl, you don't cook. You preserve it for a week. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now that my concealer has been preserved for a little bit, I'm gonna go ahead and take my beauty blender and just go ahead and blend it all out. It should be full of coverage. So now that I have blended everything out, I'm gonna go ahead and take my La Mercer powder. And I'm just gonna go ahead and set my under eye gracefully. Try to use as little emotion as you can because it be wrinkling and creasing. Sometimes when I set my makeup, I get too under eye happy and I'll like set my eyes over and over and over and then I'll do the rest of my face once. But I've realized when I do that, it cakes up. So when you're setting your eyes, just do one layer. If you're a full coverage gal like me, do your whole face and then come back and do a second layer. So you wanna do one pass of a layer of powder and then go ahead and do the rest. See, now I wanna set under the eyes again. But I have to, I can't help myself. But let's not look too crazy. I don't know if it's my own damn advice shit. So now to the star of the show, Jackie, 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 Jackie's collaboration with Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh my gosh, this is the PR package. I just can't get rid of it. I don't think I will because it's such a collector's item and Ah, uh, look how stun and extra this is. This is her in a palette. Oh my gosh, I just, I'm just obsessed. I had to put it back in the box to show you guys, but I have been using it. Ah, yes! Oh my gosh. I love her little logo that Dennis created for her. Oh, that is true love, oh my God. This is technically their first baby. Can we take a look at this in all its glory? I am fanning myself right now. The names y'all know from social media is just a one of a kind. Uh, we got trust issues, edges, dwallas. We got credit, <laughs> sponsored, supreme, pick, zam. Like the, the, the list just goes on. This is truly iconic for Jackie and I am excited to use it. First color I'm gonna go ahead and take is Supreme and brush this in the crease with my Anastasia A10 brush. This wouldn't be a Jackie recreation if I didn't do a cranberry eye. This is just so gorgeous. You know what's so crazy? I was trying to remember when I met Jackie. I don't remember because it's like ever since I've seen her channel, she has this quality of like being a friend. So when I probably met her, which I don't recall the first time, it's like I feel like I've already knew her. You know what I mean? She's always so kind and so fierce and she's always glam and put together. Makeup, no makeup, skin, skin, skin. It's just so glam. And gorgeous. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and take Pinker. Uh, this color is just right next to Supreme, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this and run this in the crease to add some definition. It is just so perfect. I'm gonna bring it all the way across the crease because Jackie has a beautiful lid space and I don't, so I'm gonna go ahead and cheat one in a crease. Well, I do have a little bit one, but you know, all this excess skin here is not the tape. So we gotta kinda treat it to make my eyes look larger. 
you know what? The blending here is just sickening. Oh, like, oh my God. I love Anastasia shadows because they just blend seamlessly into each other. I am just gagged at this blend and you can't go wrong with eyeshadows from ABH because the Norvina, she be doing that. Plus she has her collection now, I know. I got. I'm playing catch up right now. Forgive me, forgive me. Let me know if you guys wanna see a video of me turning into Norvina, okay? All right, guys, next I'm gonna go ahead and take credit. She is the deepest color, I would say. Besides big wig in here, I'm gonna go ahead and take credit. It's a beautiful crease color. She really did these colors for the brown girls in mind because these would just look stunning. See, I'm just gonna go ahead and just define like the outer corner of my eye just to add some depth and darkness. And when you're using the shadows, I like to go all the way in right here towards my nose, just right here on the inner crease. That way when I'm ready to cut the lid, you'll see the contrast with the lid color. Okay, I have to go into this Zam color on a flat brush. <sighs> she did that. I'm gonna go ahead and take my Hangover 3 in 1 Plushing Primer Spray from Too Faced, wet my brush ah it's so gorgeous and then i'm just gonna go gorgeous so i changed up the lighting so you guys can see how beautifully and glittery yes oh my god i love this color next i'm gonna go ahead and take the color next to it wigglyse and i'm just gonna blend this into oh my god into the dark Crease. Oh my god. I love blending frost metallic shadows because you could just see the dimension. Oh my god. I am obsessed. Ah! Ah! So pretty. Okay, next, let's take a little bit of Soleil Soleil and just pop this. Oh my god. Ooh. And I'm just going back with Zam and just applying this between the Soleil and the wigglies. Now that we've admired the lid in all its glory, I'm gonna go ahead and turn the lights back on and move on. And now I'm gonna toast this off, cause you know, I don't mind a little bit of fala. That's what baking can do. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and line up my gorgeous eyes with the Benefit Roller Liner. Guys, so this is where we have big decisions when it comes to like our lives, okay? It's to wing or not to wing. That's the big question. But because of Jackie, I think I'm gonna... All right, guys, my prayers worked. Yes, God, hallelujah, the liner is on. I am shooking 10. We're gonna go ahead and take this roller lash mascara and just coat the lashes and apply some big ass falsies. Do you think my lashes are thicker because of my celery juice? Because y'all, yeah, I've been drinking celery juice every day in the morning because my nail girl in Orlando had told me about it and put me on because she lost some weight. But I can tell personally that my skin be glowing. So, um, especially my under eyes because they're normally dehydrated because I'm probably not drinking enough. But oh my God, speaking of drinking enough, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Can we talk about this jug of water? I'm not sponsored by like the coldest water or anything. Look at this, it has all my times. I will link it down below. I started this at 7 p.m. It is now, it's now 10.30, so this is three hours. I drink a lot of water. I'm gonna try to do this because build your life. I'm on the right track, baby. I was born this way. Uh, fail, it's not on the front, it's on the back. <laughs> uh, this is the Born This Way powder. I'm gonna, now that I'm done with the lashes and everything, how? Gorge. I'm gonna go ahead and take this and kind of like, y'all know me, I'm just crazy about my extra coverage. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this under the eyes. Y'all know I love me a snatched ass face, so let me do this. All right, now that I've done that, I'm gonna go ahead and take Pinker and brush this. Ooh, she is gorgeous. I be loving this kind of eye. I'm gonna go ahead and take Pinker and smoke out under the eye. How cute do I look? I'm gonna go ahead and take credit and add a little bit of credit to my line. <laughs> Get it? Opening another line of credit on my waterline. <laughs> oh, y'all know so funny. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and take Stubborn Brown and just kind of like complete the look, not black, 
goes brown. I, I don't want to show my eye too much. All right, next, I'm going to take the Beauty Community shadow right here called Trust Issues and apply it on my inner corner and do the signature inner corner highlight. Oh my God, I just love this color combo. All right, now that we finished the eyes, I'm going to go ahead and take my Double Wear Powder. This is amazing because, you know, pan! I love it with my E1 brush just to add some color back into the fit. Oh my god, I hate when I get my snot on my brush. Disgusting. And this is just gonna ensure that the baking powder is off because the last thing you want is for your baking powder to flash back, okay? We know the handful of celebrities, I will not name names, with flashback. Okay guys, this has been lovely. All right, this Milani is the tea. This is the Silky Matte Suntan Bronzing Powder. This is number three. Um, in the color suntan. Oh my gosh, she is a cute color. And I like to use my E42 brush. The formula with this is just, it literally reminds me of the Marc Jacobs uh, Tantastic Omega Bronze. This is just 10 times more expensive. And oh my God, it's just as pigmented. And it's a beautiful color. And y'all know I use MAC um, Dark Deep, but this, it also smells good. And also, I'm planning on doing a full face of Milani because, you know, I really, really, really like them. And I, I remember you finding Milani, like, back in the wig store in Orlando and seeing them and seeing the craze of the Luminoso blush that Nikki loves to use, Nikki Tutorials, and they're just great. So this is probably going to be my new bronzer go-to. Just look at that. Mira el color. Este color es más barato y es más fuerte para mí. Oh, calvo. <laughs> ¿Te entiendes, Fabi? ¿Te entiendes, calvo? <laughs> no sé. Con si quiero un video en español, dame un comentario abajo. ¿Por qué no tengo arriba? <laughs> Ah, oh, me encanta ese color también para el nariz con este pincel de Iconic London. Porque el nariz es muy flat. <laughs> ¿Cómo se dice flat? Porque mi cara es como un piso. I love this color for my nose as well. Me encanta ese color también para, para el nariz. Para mí. Oh, me encanta ese color. Me encanta ese color para mi nariz. Mm -hmm. Ah, bueno. So next I'm gonna take my Laura Mercer powder. I really need to look up close for this one because this is where the magic happens, okay? Boom. Again, this is my favorite part called reinforcing. I take this step to reinforce and also to kind of erase like the bit of contour that I don't want. It doesn't necessarily erase, it just kind of brightens. So for example, like here, it's a little bit too much. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take my puff and just boom. Guys, I almost forgot my double chin. I can see a little bit of definition in my face. Y'all have been commenting, aka no one, but you know, why not? I like this color. It's really suits, it really freaking suits me. Here's a little trick. Um, I like to take MAC Studio Fix Powder in the color NW58. This is like my drag color. I like to take this and kind of just etch out a little bit of darkness right here, just to further snatch. Oh, you see, just, Works. It looks a little dark, but promise. All right, time to dust off the powder. We are ready to slay, just about. If you guys haven't tried this powder, <laughs> with it because it is so good. The Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish Powder. It's such an extra step, but it's a pricier powder, but you look like a filter. I apply this on my pores because it just fills it in. There's rose wax and almond wax in this. It's just divine. And it's not very pigmented, it's just very, very beautiful. Oh, it's so snatched. All right, next is blush. I am obsessed with this Mariah Carey Sweet Sweet Fantasy. I know it's limited edition, but it's like a, oh my gosh, I, I cannot get rid of this and I'm sorry that I'm using it. Hey, what else can I use? I, everything blush-wise I have is like limited because I just love them. This is like a much more saturated version of Peaches. Peaches is great too, but look at that. Sitting, bitch. We are just perched. You see my contour, the blush, and then my highlight. 
And I'm picky about blushes. I will say I am picky about blushes because, you know, blush goes on literally after the baking powder, the foundation powder, the highlighting powder, the bronzer, the contour, everything. So it's hard for me to find a formula that sits well on top. Some people would spray their face, which I could, but I just like to spray at the end, you know? But if you find that your blush tends to dust off because it is sitting on top of all this powder, then go ahead and by all means spray your face so it has something to stick to. A Fix Plus is great because of the glycerin in it will allow it to stick. Who is she, a product developer? No, I'm a, I'm a guru, okay? Look at the snatchery. See, I should have done my lashes at the end because now they're getting a little bit dusty, but it's okay. Nothing a little mascara cannot fix. Oh, push up your lashes, yes, push them up. This makes them like come to life, darling. Mom, what note is that? We, you're lying. Let's see. Mm, e flat or a D sharp. It's in, in the key of E flat. Our air, air conditioning. E flat in the key of E. How many flats are there in the scale? Five. <laughs> Four, You're no, three, it's not. Two. Now I gotta check. Now I gotta check. I'm flexing my music skills for y'all. Hold on. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play a scale. Hold on. Hold on. Three flats. Yes. Mm, what flats are they? The flats in order are B E A D. Am I the only one on the internet that knows music? <laughs> Peter wants to show off his musical skills, okay? Because he just felt a little bit bad that he didn't know how many flats were in the key of E, okay? Go ahead, Peter. See, I was a classically trained pianist and I was in marching band. Peter was in choir. <laughs> Shut the I was in band too. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Do it in the camera. No, go ahead. Just do it. it. Just do it. Just no, do the whole <laughs> scale. <laughs> Jackie would be so proud. Peter, Peter, Peter. Peter, it's a scale. <laughs> Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do. That's good, that's good, that's good. la, so, fa, mi, re, do. <laughs> and then I go, do, oh, mi, 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 so, so, re, fa, fa, la, ti, ti. <laughs> where's that from? Where's that from? Comment down below where's that from? if you know where that's from. <laughs> where's that from? Mary Poppins. No. No. Sound of music. Yes. Oh, I was right. <laughs> when Sing everybody you Don't. can sing most any <laughs> All right, it wouldn't be a Jackie look. Now that I have my blush, we're just gonna bleed the peaches throughout the face because Miss J is a very peachy kind of gal. So for me, what works, because y'all know I love to overline, I like to take hover and line my lips. I just can't get over my eyes really quick. Ugh, so gorgeous. Um, next for lips, I'm gonna go ahead and take Mary J. Blige from MAC. My go-to with Hover, it's so gorgeous. Or mahogany. I just apply it on the center. And I don't like to go above my lip line because that's when you see all my secrets. I'm just blending it with Hover. And for gloss, I'm gonna go ahead and take my Keep It Full Nourishing Lip Gloss by Milani in the color Luminoso. <gasps> so sexy. This is sexy in a bottle. Ugh, it's just so appropriate. I'm gonna see, I, I know y'all are like, where the f is the highlighter? I know, let me just spray my face and see, see what I wanna do, okay? All right, so for highlighter, I'm gonna take my Broken Hot and Heavy for my summer collection. I don't like, cause y'all know my texture is not the tea. It's gonna be very subtle, cause that's just, that's just kind of my gig, is that I have none with highlighter. So, just, let me just go ahead and apply just a little bit more. And then some on the forehead, just to have that sheen. We cannot forget the nose. This is where it's like the most impactful for me. Boom, it just brings the nose together. Ah, oh. isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? <laughs> All right, the highlighter is popping. See, it's just like a subtle glow, subtle glow. Let it glow, let it glow, let it glow. 
because we're well blessed to be bronze. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take my spray. This is the Hangover 3 in 1 Replenishing Primer and Setting Spray with Coconut Water Probiotic Base Ingredient and Skin Reviver, Silicone Free, Alcohol Free, Oil Free. Long ass name. But with that being said, let's go ahead and change and finish this look. Oh my god! I. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me try, let me try. Jackie, 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 Jackie. Dennis one day, y'all, because look, this is an iconic Jackie starter kit. I got the flipped out hair. I got the barrette. I got something blingy. I got me some fancy fashion off the shoulder. This is more like denty because it's more like a knockoff. But this reminds me of Jackie through and through. I love you so much, Jackie, if you're watching. Uh, congratulations to you on your collab. Definitely check out the palette if it is still sold. Um, If it's not sold out already. I love supporting amazing women like Jackie who are trailblazers in the beauty industry and she is a force to be reckoned with. I love you so much, Jackie. Congratulations to you. Um, let me know down in the comments below what you guys want to see next. If you guys want to see me do more looks, uh, maybe Norvina, maybe other collaborations that are coming out, let me know down in the comments below. Be sure to click this video right here. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye. And oh, ma'am. Ma'am. Can I speak to your manager? <laughs> And I'll...